What's up guys, it's time for the special event of the month. In case you guys do not know what a special event is, during a month I watch one movie per week, that's four movies overall, and all of the films have something in common. This month I'm watching Brazilian movies. If you guys want to vote for the final entry of this month's special event, then I will leave the link for you guys down in the description. Just vote for whatever movies you guys want me to review. By the by, I'm the movie guy and this is my review for Bakurao. Bakurao is a very strange film. It's about a village named Bakurao and all of the villagers are, are really weird. What's even weirder is what happens to them throughout the film. The town is seemingly erased off the world one step at a time. First, they don't appear on any map anymore. Then they lose their phone signal, their water source also gets destroyed and some of the villagers are killed by someone, they don't know who. But they must stop this in order to survive. This is a slow burn mystery film, unlike the other entries into the special event of the month Elite Squad in City of God, this movie might not be for everybody because the pace is very very slow. It takes the film about 50 minutes to introduce the intrigue and even after that it takes a sweet time. But for this film it works. For the entire film you feel that something wrong is going to happen and that something wrong is going to be very violent and the film's conclusion definitely does not disappoint in that regard. It left a very sweet taste in my mouth and it made me forget about the slow pace of the film. And returning to the slow pace there are just enough interesting happens before uh, that intrigue uh, that will make you want to watch this film and not close it. And the action? Well, the action is extremely bloody and violent. Think of a lot of bloody shots, of heads being blown out, of people being shot, even kids killed, and it reminded me a lot of Quentin Tarantino's films. I would have loved to see more development for certain characters, uh, it does certainly feel like some of them are just brushed aside, uh, some things happen to them but they are not entirely developed, and at the same time the film does not really explain any of its technological advances, but I don't think that it should. Its only explanation is that this film takes place a couple of years in the future in Brazil. That's how it explains that in a village where there is no clean water, there are tablets and phones. There's also an interesting drug in this uh, village of Bakurao. It's a drug that turns its inhabitants into very violent people. And I would have liked to see more backstory into it, maybe a little bit more of a detailed explanation, but that doesn't happen. The film just asks us to not ask any question and just accept it which I did. In terms of performances, this film is again on the right side. These actors were phenomenal in their job. They managed to bring out the weirdness, the sadness, the violent tendencies in each and every one of the villagers. And there is no standout performer for me. There is just a collection of very, very good performances from a very good cast. When Bakura was released, it was praised by both audiences and critics, and I understand why. It manages to blend its elements together seamlessly, and at the same time, the slow burn of this film pays off in the end with a fantastic finale. So my recommendation is that you should give this movie a watch with a rating of 4.5 stars. As I've said guys, if you want to vote on the last entry of the special event, I have left the link for you guys in the description where you guys can vote a film for me to review. And this will be the final Brazilian film of the month. Next month we'll start a new special event. If you have any thoughts on the film, go down to the comments and let me know what you think of Bakurao. While you are there, you can also press that like and subscribe button. You can press the bell to get notifications every time my videos get uploaded and until next time keep on watching movies guys yeah.